Happy to have you alongside to what should be a fantastic football showcase. The Lions. Playing on the road, always a difficult place to win. What does the traveling team have to do? Well, Gus, there's no question that uh, not only do you have to overcome a terrific football team, but you have to overcome one of the toughest environments in the National Football League. So emotionally, you almost have to find your own energy on the field the bench has to be alive you have to be cheering for each other you just have to create that raw emotion to overcome what the crowd is giving you on the other side all right chris and with that in mind time to get this one going we are anson will be kicking this one off to get us started take it from the three yard line Scheffler was there for the stop. So now the quarterback comes onto the field, and in conversations with him earlier in the week, he mentioned that he really wanted to get going early and get into a rhythm. Let's see if he can do just that. They'll take over at the 16. First down and 10. Here's the give. And with that, let's take a look at some of the key starters on offense, a group that hopes to put up some points in this one. And Chrissy is definitely primed to be a performer to watch in this one. As we introduce the key players on defense, we look no further than Indomitian Sue out of Nebraska. How do you do? He's a dominant force on the D-line. Yeah, I guess this guy for such a young player is as polished as you are. He has the instincts out there of a 10-year pro and players like him that can come in and dominate the defensive line so soon in their career. Well, you know, they're really once in a generation type players. He's wrestled down around the 38-yard line by Smith. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 38. Passes short right side. Actually loses a yard with that completion. Well, that's just great anticipation by the defense there. They saw that play coming and were all over it. It's a second and 11 situation here. Ball on their own 37. He's dragged down on the play. It brings up third and long. They'll need 15. <laughs> Surveys the field. 
Still running. He's in. Touchdown. There's just something about a ball that you know if you catch it, it's six points. And if you don't, you're going to be the go to the game. It just makes you focus a little bit more. Graham adds the extra point. Los Angeles is up a score. Number 19 will be kicking off. Logan stands back to field the kick. Yeah, the other team just scored a touchdown. They have the momentum of the game. And right now as a play caller, I think you have to be very aggressive. Try and recapture that momentum and get this game going back in your direction. They'll start at the 18-yard line. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Decides the run. He finds a lane. Let's meet the offensive starters, a unit that has some serious weapons. They call him Megatron. Calvin Johnson, a pro from Georgia Tech, is becoming one of the most exciting wideouts in the NFL. I agree. To me, he's leading the wave of the next group of great NFL wide receivers. He's got size, speed, and an unbelievable jumping ability. It's almost unfair to those guys trying to cover him. And Chrissy is definitely primed to be a performer to watch in this one. Everybody knows about this guy's arm strength, and if you wanted to see an example of it, right there it was. First down, 10 to go. Has a man to his right. It's broken up by the defender. So with that, let's take a look at some of the members of this defensive unit, a group that is looking to make a name for themselves in this matchup. tackle around the 49 yard line by 37 and we'll have a first down and 10 so the ball on the 49 Best gets the carry. He's brought down at about the 49-yard line by Bannon. Second down and seven yards to go. Ball on the 49-yard line. as he lets it go 
Under pressure, he felt the heat that time and was forced to throw it away quickly. It's third down, 10 yards for first. Throws to his right. You bring a little pressure and it impacts quarterbacks and we saw it there. It's fourth down. The Lions line up to punt. And he takes it at the 12. Man, those guys were flying down the field. He didn't have a chance on that one. His blocker's got to do something for that poor guy out there. He's going to get killed. So, from their own 15-yard line, McGahee on the handoff. He's dropped down around the 18-yard line by number 90. And it's now second and six. McGahee on the give. Scoops it, and he's still on his feet. To the 20. Well, it didn't take long to get the game's first turnover. They'll start this drive at the 16-yard line. First down and 10. Passes out to the left. Big play. The Lions will have first and goal. I wish all our fans could see what's happening down the field on all our television broadcasts because so much of the game now is won and lost in the secondary. A touchdown away from a tie. He's tackled around the five-yard line by Jamison. Four yards out from the score. Steps and throws to the left side. Makes the grab. No signal yet. We'll see what they rule. And it is a good catch. The extra point to tie this game up. Hanson is good on the point after.
Detroit is just about ready to kick this one away. Graham is deep, looking to return the kickoff. Fields the kick at the 10. He gets this one to the 26-yard line. Green was there to bring him down. The offense will take over at the 26-yard line. It's first and 10. Throws to his left. It's picked! He's wrestled down around the 43-yard line by Lee. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. They give it off here. Hit and drop behind the line. Yeah, and defensive linemen aren't the big fat guys that they used to be. These guys are athletes. They can move, and if you don't fool them on the delay, they're going to be standing right there in the face of the running back. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Goes through his progression. It's knocked down. Excellent play by the defender. As a quarterback, you have to go through your reads. That was his first look on that play, and he shouldn't have stayed with it that long. That was a bad decision. They're looking at a third down and 11. He's searching for a receiver. Pettigrew was his intended target. It's fourth down. The Lions ready to punt this one away. And it's in the end zone for a touchback. They'll go to work at the 20. First down, 10 to go. Side handoff. The coach can't be happy with him after that fumble. Priority number one has to be hanging on to the ball, right, Chris? Yeah, I guess it's so true. No team wants to give their opponent the chance to get a takeaway on a fumble, and I'm sure the coach will have a few choice words for him. You can bet the next time he touches that ball, he's going to be hanging on tight. Has a man short to his left. And he's tackled at about the 25-yard line by Smith. All it takes is a split second on a play fake for the defense to get just a little out of position. I think that's just what happened on that pass there. Third down now, five yards to go. He's going to his right. Throws. He's brought down at about the 43-yard line by number 42. And we'll have a first down and 10.
gives it up the gut. He lost yardage on the play. And when your defensive line can handle their guys up front and not allow the offensive linemen to get down on the linebackers, it really gives those linebackers a chance to look great. It's now second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own, 42. Here's the give. He's dropped down around the 49-yard line by Houston. Third down now. They'll need about three yards to convert for a new set of downs. They'll throw for the first. Ops for a short throw. He's tackled right around the 48-yard line by Carpenter. Well, that certainly was a bad break for the defense, but what a break for this offense. First down and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. Looks right, throws. He's wrestled down right around the 18-yard line by Greenwood. It's first and 10. And the ball on the 18-yard line. Give to the tailback. And he'll lose yardage on the play. And so, at the end of the first quarter, we're all even. Second down, 11 yards for first. Ball on the 20. Fires a strike to the right, completes it, and he's still perfect on the drive. What happened there, Chris? Well, they got caught in man-to-man -man coverage on that play, and I couldn't tell if the defender slipped a little bit or not. Maybe he just got beat on the play. First down and goal. He throws short. Lee made the catch for a gain of six. Offense facing second down and goal now. Two yards to the end zone. Hammered in the backfield. If you want to be considered one of the top cornerbacks in the National Football League, everybody has to be able to cover. But the top guys can not only cover, but come up and make big hits like that. Tremendous play. So here we go. It's third and goal from the one as they look to break the tie. He's going to be tackled for a loss. Did you see how fast that linebacker was on that one? Not only did he recognize it, but when he did recognize it, he had the explosiveness to get there. And this one pretty much a chip shot, about 20 yards out. And the kick is good.
Los Angeles. Yeah, it's ready to kick it away. Logan is back to receive the kick. It's fielded at the two. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. Leach was there for the stop. They'll set up shop at the 22. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. The give to the tailback. Runs for eight yards. Second down, and they're going to need just about three yards to pick up the first. Looking for a man. He avoids the rush by stepping up into the pocket. And he's tackled around the 41-yard line by LeBoy. on their own 41-yard line. Best, the ball carrier. He's brought down around the 43-yard line by LeBoy. Second down and eight here. Flips it out short to his left. He bats the ball away. Young was the intended receiver. That'll bring up third down with eight yards to go. On their own, Let's say 43. Good coverage downfield. Breaking free, and he's still running. He's looking for a burst of speed. First and 10 once again after the big game through the air. Stafford pitch out. He's dropped down right around the 26-yard line by Williams. And they line the ball up at the 26. Takes the handoff and scans the field. Everything seemed to work perfectly on that one. That was a nice job by the offensive line, allowing the quarterback enough time to survey the field and find the open guy. First down, 10 to go. And the ball on the 11 yard line. Surveys the field. He's tackled around the 10 yard line by 37. I tell you, as a defense, you don't mind giving up a little dinky throw like that to the tight end. That's good defense.
10 yards away from the end zone. Searching for an open man. Picked off. The defense comes up with a huge play in the end zone. Wow, he closed on the ball quickly and came up with the interception. Yeah, he took a risk going for the ball there because he didn't have any help behind him. But when you're that good at closing and attacking the ball, you can certainly afford to gamble occasionally. And it's amazing what talent will let you get away with. And we'll have a first down and 10. The ball is on their own 20. Still looking for an open man. Passes out to the left. He's wrestled down around the 32-yard line by number 27. First down and 10. Luck gives it up the middle. And he's tackled around the 33-yard line by Williams. Brings up second and nine. Ball is on their own 33. They'll work the left side. He's brought down at about the 33-yard line by Vanden Bosch. It's third down, nine yards to go. Short pass to his left. He's dropped down around the 39-yard line by Smith. Six-yard gain on the play. Fourth down. Looks like they're going to Punt it away here. Gets the ball at the 14-yard line. He gets this one to the 26-yard line. Jones was there to bring him down. He did a good job there finding a seam and getting up the field. You know, a lot of people don't realize that being a punt returner or a kick returner is one of the toughest jobs in the NFL. There's a whole lot of things that could go wrong and only a few that can really go right. Hands it to the back. He hasn't had a good first half at all. Just can't seem to get through this defense. from their own 29-yard line. They get it out there on the toss. Running strong downfield. And he's finally dropped at the 30. And you really have to look at your safety play anytime somebody makes a run of that distance because the very essence of playing the safety position is you have to be the last guy to protect your end zone.
It's first and ten now after the big gain on the ground. Smith takes it right side. Smith carries it for the first time today. It's first and ten, and they'll go from the 13. He's searching for a receiver. Just missed that time, bringing him down for a sack, but great pressure to force an incompletion. They'll face second down and 10. Someone jumped early down there. That penalty will move them back a bit. Sloppy play right there. The one thing you learn as an offensive player is you can't give away yards. They are just too hard to come by. He'll get it again. He didn't get back to the line. You, know, you can draw up any sort of protection scheme and blocking scheme that you want. But ultimately, this game comes down to one big man against another big man. And that time, the defense's big men, they won the battle. It brings up third and long. They'll need 15. Ball on the 18. Goes through his progression. He's going to his right. Throws. Has it on the sideline, but was he inbound? The officials will huddle. It's ruled a catch. Boy, I wasn't too sure about that one, but the officials got together and came to the conclusion that, yes, that was a good catch. And it looked like someone on the offensive line jumped. You can see even his teammates are upset about that one. You can't make that kind of a mistake on fourth down. And the kicker is on to try this one from 28. The kick is good. Detroit will be kicking off. Buchanan is deep, looking to return the kickoff. Collects it at the 7. He returns to the 26. Number 58 was there for the stop. The offense will take over at the 26-yard line. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Short throw to the left. Uh-oh! Watch out! He's tackled around the 38-yard line by number 27. Throws it deep! Left side! And he drops the short pick. Hawkins was the intended receiver on the play.
That'll make it second down with 10 to go. Ball on their own, 38. Checks down to the short pass. He's wrestled down right around the 46-yard line by Spikes. Pass completed for a gain of eight. They'll throw for the first. And it just goes to show that arm strength isn't everything. Accuracy and touch is something that is so important for a quarterback. It's fourth down. They'll line up to punt this one away. The punt rolls into the end zone. Touchback. They'll take over at the 20-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Looking for a man. Looking. Fires it to the left. Makes the grab near the sideline, but no signal yet. So after conferring, they're going to say he was out of bounds. Good try. That was a really good try, but... Let's give the officials credit. They got it right. Good coverage downfield. Picks up the ball and he can run. It's not often that a fumbled ball bounces right back to you like that. That was just good luck. There was a lot going on in that play. The booth wants to double check that the ball popped out before he was down. And this is really what instant replay was supposed to do, to help the officials have an extra set of eyes out there for these tough calls on the tough angles. And I'm sure they'll get this one right. And they will keep possession with the reverse call. Again, we have one of those kinds of calls where you have to watch two parts of the body. When was the knee down? When did the ball come out? Difficult to officiate, but they got it right. Hands it off. And he's tackled at about the 17-yard line by Jamison. So, it's fourth down. The Lions are lining up to punt it away. Buchanan fields it at the 40. That was really a good effort. There wasn't a ton of room for him to run, but he was able to get up the field, get a few yards. You never get upset with a punt return guy like that. It wasn't spectacular, but he got the job done. And we'll have a first down and 10. Ball on their own, 45. <laughs> Surveys the field. Tucks and runs. He's free. Submarines down. Boy, in that kind of situation, you just think that if they're going to pick up the first down on you, they're going to have to do it throwing the football. At that time, the quarterback got out in the open field and got it done. Hammered as he lets it go. 
Yeah, that's a great job by the defense that time getting pressure because if he had about one second more, he would have found the open receiver for the score. Second down and seven yards to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. Has a man to his right. He thinks he hauled it in, but we'll see what the officials say. They rule it incomplete. He took a stab at a great catch, but that time just didn't happen. Looks for the safe short throw. A nice play there results in a big gain through the air. Yeah, and you see the defensive back try to make a play on the ball there instead of making sure the pass fell incomplete. This guy will make a lot of big plays for his team, but sometimes it's a bit of a gamble, and that time it didn't pay off. Yeah, we'll see if he takes a more conservative approach the next time the ball is thrown in his direction. And the kicker is on to try this one from 35 yards out. It's up and it's good. We'll probably see them kick this short to end the half. He'll attempt to squib it. Pettigrew takes off from the 30. He's brought down right around the 36-yard line by Clayton. They'll go to work at the 36-yard line. First down and 10. Searching for an open man. The ball is tipped away. That'll be it for the first half of play. The score is 13-10. Welcome back to Los Angeles. Detroit will get it first here in the second half. And the tackle was made by Butler.
They'll start at the 16. It's first and 10. Throws to his right. It's now second down, 10 yards to go. The ball is on their own 16. Dumps it out right. The Lions are having a tough time getting the ball down the field in the passing game against this defense. They're facing some good coverage, and they just haven't been able to break it open. So, it is third and eight. Ball on the 18-yard line. Looks right. Throws. He's knocked out of bounds at the 46-yard line. And so far in this one, as you can see, this player has been the impact performer of the game so far. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 46. Dumps it out left. He's dropped down at about the 43-yard line by Williams. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 43. They weren't able to get the playoff. That will cost them five. And it will come back. Penalty on the offense. One thing we've learned about this defense, it's hard enough to move the football against them. You cannot help them with these penalties. Inside give. He's tackled around the 42-yard line by Jamison. Second down and eight here. He's wrestled down right around the 40-yard line by Pickett. Third down, seven yards to go. Pass is short right side. And he's tackled around the 35-yard line by Greenwood. Good-looking screen pass that time. It could have gone for a little extra if they'd gotten one more block. That was close. Fourth down. The Lions lining up to punt. Well, their offense will now come onto the field in excellent position, already leading in this game. They'll get the ball here at the 20. 
And we'll have a first down and 10. They'll give it off here. He's brought down around the 21-yard line by Spikes. From their own 22-yard line. Hands it to the back. Stiff arms, and the defender still makes the tackle. First down and 10. Breaking through up the gut. He's dropped down around the 49-yard line by Delmas. It's first and 10. Ball on the 49-yard line. Goes through his progression. He's tackled around the 47-yard line by number 27. Good defense all over the field that time. They had the deep routes covered, and when they tried to dump it off to the tight end, they were on it. It's a second and eight situation now. McGahey on the give. They pick up two yards. And looking at a third and six right here. So the ball on the 45. Short throw to the right. It is an incomplete pass. Yeah, I think he would have needed a jackhammer to get that one in there. That was tight coverage. They line up at the 45. And now their offense will come onto the field in great position to get back into this game. The offense will take over at the 20-yard line. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Passes it deep on the left side. He drops the easy pick. Young was his intended target. They'll face second down and 10. Best gets the carry. He didn't get back to the line. And when your defensive line can handle their guys up front and not allow the offensive linemen to get down on the linebackers, it really gives those linebackers a chance to look great. That brings up third and ten. He's searching for a receiver. So the offense will probably head off the field after failing 
to convert for a first down on that series. Well, you're going to have to gather the troops over on the sideline because whether it was poor play calling or poor execution, they never got anything going that time. It's fourth down. The Lions are lining up to punt this one away. Buchanan fields it at the 40. The stop was made by Greenwood. You know, I like that return. Nothing flashy, but it was really effective. The thing I hate to see are guys that are dancing around back there trying to be a playmaker when they're really not. At least he got up the field, got a few yards. That's what I like to see. Going down the middle with it. He's wrestled down around the 43-yard line by number 58. That's a 10-yard gain. It's second down. They only need a couple of inches for the first. They tackle him for a loss. Well, those defenders get paid, too, and every once in a while they win the battle. Clearly that time they were all over this offensive line. That'll make it third down. The offense needs about three feet for the first. It's the tailback. It appears to be short. And you love to see those linebackers playing downhill like that. Not just flowing sideline to sideline, but attacking and trying to get in the backfield. Looks like they decided to go for it here. Has a man to his right. And he's tackled around the 44-yard line by Williams. They'll set up shop at the 44-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Stafford flips it out. He's going to be tackled for a loss. And I really like the discipline of this defense. You never see these guys trying to do too much. They control their gaps, and that time there was nowhere to go. Second down, 11 yards for a first. Looks left. Here's a short pass. He's one of those quarterbacks who trusts his arm maybe a little bit too much. He should have never thrown that ball. They're looking at a third down and 11. On their own, let's say 43. Steps and throws to the left side. The pass is broken up. What a play. And that will be a three and out for the offense after that incompletion. And it really looked like the defense won the battle up front. The big guys controlling the line of scrimmage made the difference there. So, it's fourth down. The Lions ready to punt this one away. Yeah. 
Fields the punt at the 19-yard line. And the tackle was made by Green. That was really a good effort. There wasn't a ton of room for him to run, but he was able to get up the field, get a few yards. You never get upset with a punt return guy like that. It wasn't spectacular, but he got the job done. Oh, he's off. He's brought down right around the 34-yard line by number 27. Second down and very short yardage here. Fumble on the play. Detroit falls on it and they have the turnover. Well, there's really never a good time for a fumble, but you can tell that he just got sloppy with that football. He broke down on his fundamentals and he gave it up. They'll start this drive at the 24-yard line. And we'll have a first down and 10. Deep pass. He wants the end zone. So they'll face a second and ten. Dumps it out right. It's almost picked off. Young was the intended receiver. Here they have a third down and 10 to go. Ball on the 24. Passes short right side. He's dropped down right around the 16-yard line by Williams. They call on the field goal unit. The kick is good. Hansen is just about ready to kick this one away. Buchanan is back to receive the kick. He'll return it from the six. He gets it back out to the 20-yard line. Greenwood was there for the stop. They'll start at the 20. First down and 10. Hands it off. Breaks a tackle and finds running room. And he's finally dropped at the 50. And you really have to look at your safety play anytime somebody makes a run of that distance. Because the very essence of playing the safety position is you have to be the last guy to protect your end zone.
Fresh set of downs following the big run. Running out of time. And they got him. Now in a second and long following the sack. He plays it safe and throws it away. Here's a third and long situation. Ball on their own 42. Looks left. Loads it up. Right through his hands. He almost had the pick. That's the end of three. And get ready for an action-packed fourth quarter with this game all tied up. It's fourth down, and the punt unit onto the field to kick it away. He angles it out of bounds at the 14. He really did a nice job there, pinning them back inside their own 20. Anytime you can force an offense to start inside their own 20, it really gives you an edge. They'll take over at the 14. It's first and ten. Best takes the give. He's tackled around the 18-yard line by Williams. Second and six yards to go. He's wrestled down right around the 20-yard line by number 58. Just about four yards shy of the first here on third down. Best gets another carry. Uses a stiff arm, but the defender is still able to drop him. Yeah, the offensive line did their job. They created enough of a seam to get him up into the secondary, and then he was able to explode from there. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. They spot it at their own 32. Flips it out short to his left. Pettigrew gains about five yards on the play. It's second and five here. Ball on their own, 37. Short pass to his left. And he's tackled at about the 41 by Buchanan. That reception is good for a gain of four.
Short yardage situation here. They'll need a little less than a yard to convert. They'll throw for the first. He's brought down at about the 47-yard line. My Wilson. So they line up at the 47. Smith gets the call. You know, you can draw up any sort of protection scheme and blocking scheme that you want. But ultimately, this game comes down to one big man against another big man. And that time, the defense's big men, they won the battle. Facing a second at 11. Ball on the 47-yard line. Hand off to the right. Brought down behind the line. Did you see how fast that linebacker was on that one? Not only did he recognize it, but when he did recognize it, he had the explosiveness to get there. The offense has looked very good on third down so far on this drive. Going two for two. Let's see what happens here. Throws to his left. And he drops the short pick. And the pass will fall incomplete. Fourth down coming up. And those are the kind of big third down plays you have to have on defense to get the ball back and give your team a chance on offense. Fourth down. The Lions lining up to punt. The ball goes into the end zone. Touchback. He'll take over at the 20. The offense will start at the 20-yard line. First down. 10 to go. Short throw to the left. He's dropped down right around the 22-yard line by Vanden Bosch. That play was really made by the coverage down the field in the secondary. Forced the quarterback to go to the check down throw, and then they came up and made the tackle. It's a second and eight situation now. So they have the ball on their own 21. Has a man short to his left. He'll be brought down behind the line of scrimmage. That's a four-yard loss. As a quarterback, sometimes you just have to see a play breaking down and get rid of the football and try it again on the next down. So they line up at the 18. Deep on the left side. He's tackled right around the 28-yard line by Delmas. The offense has another first and ten after that big gain through the air. McGahee on the handoff. He's wrestled down around the 28-yard line by number 58.
They'll face second down and 10. The ball on the 28. Short throw to the right. And he's tackled around the 25-yard line by Houston. That's a three-yard gain. Always a dangerous play when you get a wide receiver in the open field against man coverage. But that time, the defense was there and made a nice open field tackle. So the offense needs seven here on third down. Still looking for an open man. Has a man out to his right. Tip pass, and it's incomplete. The defender gets a hand on it, and that will bring up fourth down. Just terrific play by the defense. They followed the quarterback's eyes, made a quick jump on the ball, and were all over that one. This one will be from 42 yards out. He splits the uprights. Makes the long one with room to spare. It really was, wasn't it? There are no field goal kicker jokes going on on the sideline right now. Just a lot of love. Number 19 will be kicking off. Young stands back to field the kick. He'll return it from the one. Gets to about the 24 before going down. Number 47 was there to bring him down. They'll get the ball here at the 24-yard line. And we'll have a first down and 10. Good coverage downfield. He's brought down at about the 49-yard line by Williams. First down and 10. So the ball on the 49. Best takes it up the middle. Second down and eight here. Surveys the field. Steps and throws to the left side. And it just goes to show that arm strength isn't everything. Accuracy and touch is something that is so important for a quarterback. Passing situation for the offense here on third down and long. Goes through his progression. And looking right, he lets it go. Nearly picked off. He should have had that one. And the pass was knocked away at the last minute. Well, at the end of the game, you go back and you basically say what happened on third down, and you have a pretty good indication of how that game came out. Good play by the defense. So, it's fourth down. The Lions ready to punt this one away. Yeah. 
And they down it at the two. When you go for a punt to pin a team deep in their own territory, the last thing you want to have happen is to have it end up in the end zone for a touchback because it just is a letdown for the punt team. Now you've got them backed up inside the 10-yard line. Nice play. McGahee off the right side. He's dropped down around the four-yard line by Levy. They're looking now at second and eight. Luck hands it off straight ahead. He's tackled around the seven-yard line by Smith. It's a third and five situation. Ball on their own seven. Number 34 on the inside handoff. And just when you thought this offense was going to have a chance to really put this thing away, the defense comes up with a huge stop. They'll have to punt the football away. And now offensively, you have a chance to win it at the end. And with that, the two-minute warning is reached. Two minutes left in the ball game. Logan fields the ball at the 44. You know, I like that return. Nothing flashy, but it was really effective. The thing I hate to see are guys that are dancing around back there trying to be a playmaker when they're really not. At least he got up the field, got a few yards. That's what I like to see. Goes for it all. He comes down with it. Touchdown. What a way to grab the lead. They go up by three, and assuming he adds the extra point here, that lead becomes four. And that extra point is awfully big because then you would need a touchdown to win this one. And the point after is good. Detroit is up by four. Just under two minutes to go in this one. Detroit is just about ready to kick this one away. Buchanan is back to receive the kick. Here we go. He'll return it from the four-yard line. He gets to about the 27 and goes down. Scheffler was there for the stop. They'll go to work at the 27. It's first and 10. for a short throw. Nine-yard pickup on the pass. They'll hurry back to the line. And it looked like someone on the offensive line jumped. 
Well, that's more than a little humiliating for an offensive lineman. Unfortunately, there's nowhere to hide after one of those. And yeah, they know national television is going to be talking about them as well. Looking, fires it to the left, makes the catch, and he's dropped. And it appears we have an injury on the field. Now we have a first down and 10 to go. Looks for the safe short throw. He's wrestled down around the 47-yard line by Green. Lee catches it for a gain of five. Searching for an open man. Makes the reception and they knock him out. He picks up a first. The rookie tearing it up today. Over 100 yards receiving now. Pretty good route runner, but I really like the way that he fights for that extra yardage. First down, 10 to go. And they'll spot it at the 27. Throws it deep to the end zone. It's tipped away. Great defense. Hawkins was the intended receiver. Second down and seven yards to go. A minute to go in the ball game. Rolls to his right. He's dragged down on the play. They hurry to the line. He's looking towards the left side. Too close to call. Here comes the chain game. Yes, he got there. First down. They go to their hurry-up offense. Passes out to the left. He thinks he hauled it in, but we'll see what the officials say. And it is a good catch. Trying to go up by three, they'll kick the extra point. Point after is good. Los Angeles has a three-point cushion.
Los Angeles is ready to kick this one off. Logan is deep, looking to return the kickoff. And he gathers it at the six-yard line. And we have a flag on the play. And that was the last thing the offense needed. Here's the call on the field. Moore was there to bring him down. A bit of poor judgment on that play. You have to be aware of the situation, and that's a big first down. And we'll have a first down in 10. Looking for a man. And looks left. Throws. Wow, was that a bad throw. I don't know if the ball slipped out of his hands or what, but you have to make that one. So they'll face a second and ten. The Rock is on their own 13. Let's it go deep. Still running. And he's running with a purpose now. He's knocked out of bounds at the 23. Stafford has done an excellent job of leading the aerial attack in this one, racking up over 300 big ones through the air. The big gain through the air sets up the offense with another first and ten. They'll work the left side. Big play. The Lions will have first and goal. Nothing makes a defensive coordinator cringe more than seeing that kind of run because then it sets up the play action, and there's almost no way to stop an offense if you can't stop the run and you have to deal with play action. They line up the kicking team. This one is about a 25-yarder. They call on the field goal unit. The kick is up, and it's perfect. That kick just really gave his team new life. Yeah, that was a big kick to tie this game, but now the focus really shifts to your defense. They have to come out, make a stop, try and take this thing into overtime where you can win it. Hansen gets ready to kick it away. Buchanan stands back to field the kick. Taken from the three-yard line. The stop was made by Barrett. Well, looks like we're going to get some bonus football. Both teams will head into overtime. All knotted up. So before we get started with our overtime action, let's catch you up on the changes the National Football League owners just recently passed in the offseason. Yeah, guys, basically the big difference this year is that if the team that wins the coin toss in overtime goes down and kicks a field goal, then the other team is going to be allowed a possession to try and either tie the game or win it going the other way. And if they tie it, then you just continue in overtime and it becomes sudden death at that point. Best gets the carry. And he's tackled around the 24-yard line by number 58.
from their own 24-yard line. Has a man out to his right. And he's dropped as soon as he makes the catch. First down and 10. Has a man open in the middle. He's brought down at about the 47-yard line. By 37. It's first and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. it to the back he's dropped down around the 44 yard line by Williams second down and seven ball on the 44 Inside give. He's tackled at about the 43-yard line by Williams. The offense is now looking at third and five. Passes short right side. The quarterback is having some success with this matchup. What do you see here, Chris? Well, after a big gain like that, the quarterback may try to target this guy for really the rest of the game. It'll be interesting to see how this matchup progresses now that he's found a bit of an opening. Now we have a first down. And 10 to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Gives it to the back. He's wrestled down at about the 27. By Pickett. Just about three yards there. Second down and eight here. They'll keep it on the ground again. Yeah, the offensive line did their job. They created enough of a seam to get him up into the secondary, and then he was able to explode from there. This will be about a 36-yard field goal. Win it! What a finish! That wraps up this one. We have highlights next, so stick around. And let's take a look at the Gatorade Performer of the Game.